And up first at 11 tonight, a celebration for the godfather of Go-Go. As tonight, friends and loved ones honored the life of Chuck Brown on the anniversary of his death. He was a trailblazer in the history of D.C.'s music scene. He was beloved throughout the district. And right now, Chuck Brown's all-star Go-Go tribute band is headlining a concert at the Howard Theater. Tom Rousey live now with more on what's been a big night. Tom? And Allison, that concert just about to get underway. In the meantime, we've got kind of a street party going on outside the Howard Theater here. A lot of folks hanging around and a lot of folks still in line over here waiting to get in for this tribute show, which is going to start in a few minutes. Let me show you the scene. We just shot this minutes ago inside the Howard Theater. There is a huge crowd, really just a packed house, waiting for this tribute concert to start. It is one year to the day since Chuck Brown passed away at age 75 after complications with pneumonia. But I got to tell you, his music lives on, and that is evidenced by how many people came out tonight. They say they intend to have a very good time remembering a go-go legend. Before the Chuck Brown tribute began, it was the Chuck Brown go-go workout that grabbed everybody's attention tonight. Chuck Brown means everything to me growing up in D.C. Danette Tucker led the workout. For she and many other D.C. natives, Chuck Brown music brings back a lot of memories. Several people shared their favorite. When he would do live festivals outside because it would bring every race, creed, and color together. I used to sneak into the programs, you know, at 14 years old. That was my best memory, being up in the balcony, you know. Um, coming here was like, you know, a getaway. Honey, his knees and them boots, baby. When he turned his feet in, you know he was getting ready to say, come on, baby. Many here knew Brown personally. Always loved him, his family. And they wanted to pay tribute to him tonight because they say he left a big mark on this town and growing up here wouldn't have been the same without him and his music. No town or no city has but Washington, D.C. The good go-go. The godfather go. Chuck was the epitome of love, and he did it through go-go music. And he always brought this city together. That's why the city loves him so much. And the Howard Theater here, of course, reopened last year. But before that, it was shut down over 30 years. But back in the day, before it shut down, Chuck Brown used to play here all the time. And so many folks we talked to tonight used to see him back then. I talked to one lady who saw him all the time back in the 70s. She said, tonight, I'm going to remember him, and I'm going to party like it's the 70s all over again. Folks here say, by having a good time at this, that's how they can remember Chuck Brown and pay tribute to his go-go music. Live tonight in Northwest, I'm Tom Rousey, ABC 7 News. Tom, 